Hey guys, um, I wanted to redo my iPhone video, what's on my iPhone, because now I have a phone case, a really cute pink polka dot phone case, and it's super cute, and I got this case for my phone, like, last week, I ordered it from Amazon.com, it actually comes in, I had, like, it was, like, two for three dollars, it came in a pink polka dot one and a blue polka dot one, so, of course, I'm using the pink now, and it also came in baby blue, which I'm saving um, until, like, if I ever need to change it or whatever. But I'm pretty happy with the pink one because pink is my favorite color. The only thing I love these um, phone cases, I really love them. They're so super cute. The only thing is they're kind of, like, hard to put back on once you take them off. But as long as you, you kind of have to, like, fool with it a little bit and make sure they're on there super tight. Um, but, yeah, I mean, so most of the time I just leave this one on. And so let's get started. I'm also going to show you, after this, two new Bath & Body Works candles that I bought last week because I got them two for 20 for the large three-wick candles. Um, but I'll show those to you after I show the video. So yeah, this is my iPhone 4. Um, I got this about a couple of weeks ago. Um, let's start with what I have on my phone. Okay. So, of course, I have the App Store, the App Store right there, and I have my calendar. I have messages, you know, for text messages. Um, I do use Instagram, so I use Instagram on my phone, and um, if you want to follow me on Instagram, it's love, L-U-V, Angela, A-N-G-E-L-A-X-O. So, it's love, L-U-V, Angela, X-O is my username. Um, I also have the Insta... It's called InstaFrame. I use the InstaFrame. That's like when you want to put um, borders on your pictures. You know, you can put like borders on there and stuff. Like if you want to put like three pictures in one or two pictures in one, whatever. Um, I really like that app. It's really cool. Um, I also have, um, of course, photo, camera, and videos on there. Um, I do have um, MapQuest, which I use. Um, you know, just when I need directions and stuff like that, like you just enter your address and where you're going and it tells you how to get there. So yeah, I do have MapQuest on it. Um, I do have my notes section, which of course you just use to write notes. Um, I do have the reminders. I have stocks, which comes in the phone already. The stocks thing, which is right there. Um, I have the clock. Okay, this is Song Pop Free. It's called Song Pop, and I love Song Pop. Um, Song Pop is right there. Um, I really love that game. It's so amazing. It's like on Facebook, too, um, if you want to look it up on Facebook. But you play against another person, and they play like a little snippet of a song, probably like a like 20 or 30 second version of a song. And then you have to guess what song it is. Like you play against one other person. And it's up to you. Whoever guesses it fastest and correctly wins. And you keep playing it. It's like, and it ends in like a week. So you start a new tournament like every seven days. So I think it's really fun. Um, next I have um, phone, the phone tab, the music tab. Um, I'm not going to play any of the songs because I don't think you're really supposed to play them in here because I like copyright and stuff. But um, I have a lot of songs in here. Some of the songs I have. Um, I have, um, like, Boys to Men, I have Monica, I have, um, Tony Braxton, R. Kelly, Tevin Campbell, a lot of, like, 90s R&B, because I love 90s R&B stuff, and I love rock music, so I have me rock and metal, like, Him in Flames, um, Suicide Commando, which is, like, a industrial kind of goth band, um, I have some Whitney Houston on there, I have The Monkees, I have, um, New Edition, Shy, Wumscut, which is another industrial goth band. Um, I have um, Whitney Houston again, uh, Boys to Men, Nine Inch Nails, Incubus, Grendel, um, Aaliyah, Rest in Peace Aaliyah, I love Aaliyah, Mary J. Blige, I even have Paris Hilton, the song The Stars Are Blind, because I love that song. It came out like five years ago, I think. I have um, Grendel, which is another industrial goth kind of band. Um, I do have Justin Bieber song in there too. Um, I have, um, just a bunch of stuff. As you, as you can see, my taste varies. I can listen to like R&B, which is like, I prefer the 90s R&B. 
and then I can listen to like rock like Incubus and Nine Inch Nails and him and I can listen to metal like In Flames or um what is another metal band I like um like Rob Zombie and um there's another metal band I really like I'm trying to think of who they are oh Children of Bodom okay so anyways yeah I do have the music and then I have my email tab which is I use you know just for like emails and I have my email addresses set up and then I have um this really cool game it's called Tiny Tower. Tiny Tower is right there. Um, I love Tiny Tower. It's just a game where you um, like these like little people and they, they have like a big tower and like you they, they go up an elevator and they pick what floor they want to go on. So you have to send them up there and then you have like businesses and you have to make sure the businesses are stocked with all the merchandise. And you just kind of like earn points and I'm up to 20, let me see. Let me see how many buildings I'm up to. Um, I have 13 buildings. Wait, 13 floors? I thought I had more than that. Okay, well, yeah, I'm up to like 13 floors. So that's Tiny Tower for you. And um, I'm almost ready to build my 14th floor coming up soon. And then I have my newsstand. I don't really have anything on the newsstand, though. It's just in there. Um, Safari, iTunes, um, settings, weather see right there the weather right now it is in 57 degrees where I live so not too bad kind of cool but not really cold um, I have life clip which is life clip right there it's just a photo sharing um, site like Instagram it's kind of the same except Instagram is better but I really use life clip sometimes too but I prefer Instagram it's kind of the same thing just a little different um, you just kind of like log in and then you can like see your feed and like you know see you know um what people are posting and stuff like that and the setup is different than instagram but this is still pretty cool i guess and you can just see like what different people are posting when you scroll down like that so yeah so that's it um okay and then um Let's see, after Life Clip, of course, I have YouTube on there, YouTube. Um, I have Pandora, love Pandora Radio, Pandora is right there. And I have a bunch of different stations um, that I'm listening to right now. Um, I have, I'm waiting for it to load, it's coming up. Okay, see, Kill Hannah automatically came up, Kill Hannah. And um, let me see what else. I have like Justin Bieber Radio, In Flames Radio, Anthrax Radio, Kill Hannah Radio, Kicks Radio, Troop Radio, Pretty Boy Floyd Radio, a bunch of bands you might not know, Him Radio, Warrant Radio, Christmas Radio, Britney Spears Radio, Mandy Moore Radio, New Order Radio. That's just a couple of things. Um, now it's still playing Kill Hannah, Looks Like Morphine. I love that song, by the way. And um, let me see what I'm up to. Okay, I do have these Walt Disney World screensavers. Um, these are really cool screensavers that you can put on your phone. And it just has, like, different screensavers. You can put these are all Walt Disney World um, photos that you can use as screensavers. And it's really cool because with, like, Christmas coming up, they have some really pretty Christmas ones. It's just called um, WDW Holiday. That's it. And then I have a Stick'em app. Um, Stick'em, I don't know how many of you are familiar with Stick'em. It's like blog TV, but better. You can just view people that are live, enjoying their chat room, and go on camera and talk to them. So I do use Stick'em. It's just a Stick'em like that. And you can either be a viewer or a broadcaster. You can view or broadcast it like that. Um, I have TwitVid. The TwitVid that you can just use to make videos for Twitter. Um, I have a wallpaper, like some wallpaper, a wallpaper tab just with random wallpapers, my contacts. I have a compass. I have Fruit Pop. Fruit Pop is a really cool game where you like, it's a game. I don't know if you know what Fruit Pop is, but it's super cool. You just kind of just like, um, you're like play with fruits and like the fruits like, you know, earn coins and stuff like that. You have to like try to match them like three, four, five in a row. Like, they have to go, like, diagonal or straight across or 
but you have to match them like either three, four, three or four, I think, in a row of like the matching fruits. Then I have my music tab, like I said, I have my mail, Tiny Tower. Um, let's see, okay, I do have, this is called Jane, Jane Hero. It's like a hotel game, like where this lady owns a hotel and you have to like, um, you have to like cater to the guests and like check them in and all that stuff. It's called Jane's Hotel, right? Oops, right there. It's, it's just called Jane's Hotel. Um, so I think it's a really cool app. That's what it looks like right there, the first one. Then I have Barbie, which is an clo endless closet. Um, it's just a Barbie game, just Barbie fashionistas. And I still like Barbie. I don't care what anyone thinks, but I love Barbie. And it's just kind of cool. It's just like, if you're a Barbie fan, you'll like having that on your phone. Then I have Weemi, which is just, you can make your own, like, Weemi avatar. It's super cool. You can just create it. And, um, let me show you what mine is. Okay, this is what my Weemi av avatar looks like. Super cute. And that's pretty much all you do with that, I think. Um... See, I have another wallpapers HD thing. It's like another um, wallpaper app right there. I have my calculator, my calculator. I have find iPhone. This will like find your iPhone if you ever lose it or anything. Um, Beautify free right there. It's just an application where you can like change your hair color or eye color. And it kind of shows you what it looks like. I have the free basic version. I'm sure that uh, the one that you have to pay for is a little bit better, but it's just called Beautify and you can change your hair, eye color, skin resurface, and then you can actually share the photo. Um, I have Fandango. I haven't really used it yet because I haven't been like to the movies lately or anything, but Fandango it just like gives you movie times and showings and stuff like that. Um, I have a Target application, the Target app. It lets you browse Target, and you can browse the sales at Target. You can even shop online, I think, using that app. So it's pretty cool. Then I have a voice memo. You know, it comes standard in the phone. Like, if you want to create a voice memo, I use Tweetcaster for Twitter. Um, I do use Tweetcaster. I just kind of like it because it's like, I don't know, the basic Twitter is okay, too, but I use Tweetcaster now. And I also have Echo Phone, which is another Twitter application. Um... Ringtones, I have ringtones, um, but you can kind of just like um, create and then you can like download them from iTunes and stuff. Um, so yeah, so the ringtones that I have, it's just, um, you just download it to iTunes and then when you do it, then you can copy it back to your phone from your computer or whatever. Then I have the Christmas countdown. I put Christmas and Thanksgiving. It's just called the countdown thing. And... That's what it looks like. Um, see, this says Thanksgiving right there. There is two weeks, two days, 18 hours, 33 minutes, and 37 seconds to Thanksgiving. And then I have one for Christmas, too, which is super cool. I put Minnie and Mickey Mouse Christmas picture as the background. For Christmas, there's one month, two weeks, five days, 18 hours, 33 minutes, and 25 seconds. So it's just a countdown thing that I thought was super cute. Then I have an e-online tab. Because I love E! Online and I love E! News and stuff. So I use that just to keep me updated on entertainment news. And then I have my phone. Oh, that's stuff that's... Okay, two more applications and then I'm done. I have NBA Game Time. I love NBA. That's the only sport I watch. I'm not into sports except basketball, NBA. I love the Lakers. Lakers are my favorite team. So I keep up to date with all the games and scores on NBA Game Time. And I watch them on my TV, of course. I prefer watching games on my TV. Um, rather than watch them on the phone, and plus I think you have to pay to watch them on the phone, so I don't know. But NBA Game Time keeps me up to date, like if I'm not by TV when I want to check a score of a game. But the Lakers won uh, last night against Detroit, their first win, woohoo, and they won like by 20 points, so I'm super happy. And then I, last but not least, I have my eBay tab. Um, eBay is just the place, you know, of course you know what eBay is, but um, I have the eBay tab and I like to use it on the phone sometimes. And this is my screensaver. It's the Walt Disney Castle. It's super pretty. I got it from the Christmas um, screensavers that I showed you before. So I use this as my screensaver. And it's so funny because on eBay, I just sold my Blackberry on eBay a couple of days ago. The phone that I had before this, that I upgraded from the Blackberry to this, I was able to sell my Blackberry on eBay for like 25 bucks. So that's pretty cool. Okay, so you saw what's on my iPhone. 
And I do pretty much have a lot of applications and I'm so happy I got a new um, cover and everything. So let me get to the two candles I bought from Bath & Body Works. Marshmallow Fireside, this smells really, really good. I got it last Wednesday and I've used quite a bit of it as you can see. Mm, it just smells really good. If you like marshmallow, the smell of marshmallows, like and roasted marshmallows, you will love this candle. And they have the sale two for 20, so I was able to get one more. This is another super good one. This is, I think, a newer one from their winter collection, I believe. Peach Bellini. If you love the smell of peaches, if you love peaches, mm, this is the candle for you. This is the candle we keep in the living room, so it's a little bit more used than um, my candle, which is I keep the marshmallow one in my bedroom. This one stays in the living room, and my mom lights it sometimes. I light it sometimes. So instead of one person just using it, there's two. So it's a little bit more um, used up. And yeah, but these are pretty big candles. But this one has definitely been used a little bit more. But I like them both. It's hard to pick a favorite, but if I had to, hmm, I would pick the Marshmallow Fireside. But I still love the Peach Bellini. But they're just, they're both, they smell both really good. They're almost equal. But if I had to choose, I would pick Marshmallow Fireside. But I really, really, really love this one, too. Well, I have made this video long enough. It's over 16 minutes. So I just wanted to show you what was on my iPhone. I hope you enjoy it. And I will talk to you later. Have a great week. Bye. Oh, oh and by the way, um, before I go, I did want to say go Obama. I do hope he wins the presidency. And um, we will see what happens on Tuesday. But I'm an Obama supporter. And I also wanted to say um, I donated to the Red Cross today $10 to the victims in New York and New Jersey that went through that horrible hurricane. And it's really easy to text, guys. If you want to text $10, all you have to do is text um, donate to 90999. And it, that goes to the Red Cross. And um, my heart just goes out to those people because I can't imagine what it's like to have no electricity and to go through all of that terrible weather and my friend has a friend from New Jersey that she talks to sometimes but like hasn't posted in like seven days so she's kind of worried about him and um ever since the storm came he hasn't posted on Twitter and so we hope he's okay I don't really know him but she knows him kind of through Twitter and he lives in New Jersey so um I just pray that everyone gets their life back together um soon there because it's really a tragic event and looking at the pictures, it's just hard to imagine that even happened, but it did. And God, my heart goes out to them and God bless everyone there that's affected. But anyways, um, I will talk to you later and I hope you guys have a great week. Bye. Oh, I think I set something up differently.